Welcome back to Key Talk Media. This your host, Key Talk. Check it out, man. All right. You already know. I want to give a shout out to Notification Gang and Key Talk Gang, even though they're really the same thing, for rocking with me every single video. If you listen to my voice right now, go ahead and like the video and hit the bell so you get a notification every time I drop a video. Yeah. Any Lil Dirk's affiliate, Mimo 600, OTF Mimo, you already know. Buddy was actually in a car crash last night. He actually posted it on his IG stories. First, he was actually pulled over and he posted that first. Now, will the Chirac Savage make it out from being pulled over by 12 or will he have guns and drugs on him? He made it out anyways. A few hours later, he actually posted another picture and went back to his Instagram. Now, this picture was a picture of a vehicle that was completely destroyed, windows knocked out, the tire messed up, and it pretty much looks like his vehicle had ran into either another vehicle or some type of, you know, object or something like that because the front of his vehicle is completely destroyed. As you can see, of course, there's nobody inside that vehicle at all. It's literally just the vehicle itself, no injuries or nothing like that uh, to anyone that's actually inside of it. Of of course, outside of that vehicle is Mimo 600, where he did say that his back was actually broken. Mimo 600's exact words were, I broke my back, my backbone. I have on a back brace and plenty more. Pray for me. I love you guys. Steve Ann's booming. Y'all was with me on this morning. And I guess those people that he actually just named off the Steen Ann's booming is probably somebody that actually passed away. So it's one of his partners and his homies. And speaking of partners and homies, and a blue hell is famous Dex partners and homies at brother buddy just got arrested again and his bail is set at three hundred and fifty thousand dollars now y'all might remember he literally just got out of jail maybe like not even two or three months ago but he's already back again for violating his probation pretty much the report says famous Dex was just sent back to jail after a hearing where it was found he didn't follow the terms of his probation and the terms were wearing his ankle monitor attending domestic violence violence classes, taking drug tests, paying restitution to his victim, of course, because he went there, uh, originally went to jail for the domestic violence. You already know. Pretty much the last three pictures that Buddy posted on his Instagram, it was no typo ankle monitor at all. And also, he did a show. He posted a footage of a show. No typo ankle monitor at all. You already know. At this point, not only are the people around him not making sure that he's doing what he needs to be doing, even though he's a grown man and that's his own responsibility, but it's kind of like he don't care about getting locked up at all because he's consistently doing what he's not supposed to do and he literally just got out of jail anyways so as more details come out about pill popping dicks and also memo 600 of otf i'll definitely keep the gang updated let me know some coming down below let me know what you think about this entire ordeal i'm out